some A songs. Hot coffee and honey. Hot coffee, a tad more poetry, a bit more honey, inspiration of plenty, went without resolve. A puzzle of peculiar pieces, difficult it seems at first to solve, yet salve to old wounds wound tight as a bandage round are found to comfort a soul's unease at pending night. J9. Enough of this rainy day, this chilly night. I wait to finish my wine, turn out the light. Curiosities abound ere I turn to dreamscape. If I can find J9, my clothes to drape, covers to turn in quest of a gathering warm, as lingering image of her smile seeks to charm my late libido. Mere thought of her excites it. Circumambient love, diver, quester, elegant author, connected dots today, tears for Gaia shall flood the realm save for pinnacles, love, real, shared unconditionally may be the only path to the light, may be the only road to salvation, as paths go one is sought for one more quest for fulfillment of dreams, if dreams continue to come true. Dream peace, dream rainforests, dream crystal clean waters, dream circumambient love for all the world. And oh man, that is a sincere poem. As patterns go. As patterns go across the country from west to east, bearing weather, Today's nine is a nine nonetheless for being somewhat heady in Minnesota. Beneath that number, doing a number on numbers of folks whose lives end or radically change as a result, is the number of times or the nines. What size fines would be fair to levy upon the doer of dark deeds done to so many so often so savagely? As numbers go, incalculable. In the palpable post-pattern party, the mainframe news channels ride tornadic clouds into living rooms of zombies programmed to wait for noose. Some there, that there are, that choose another view, where truth in a plain wrapper gave two days notice of nines and numbers and nuances, such as scalar, ring return, sawtooth, etc. As patterns go, those are the real deal. Fate seems sealed as more is revealed about the good deal gone bad or usurped. However, I believe in the wild card of life, as patterns go. Late Oil I burn late oil tonight as my youngest son finds delight with computer capers in hours we. I find I'm thankful for him assisting me to close in on setting up devices to help me with my poetry. Really, help me file and revise, perhaps. Beyond that, to print becomes a thought. Yet, another thought reminds me to complete the cover of a tardy gift too long and complete. To conquer that would be awesome. Positive energy. I would be, I would selfish be, were I not to share joy of this spring washing over me. Shades of early green alone could fill a tome as myriad butterflies delight my eyes. Gardens are growing. Ah, my heart is glowing with this April surge of positive energy. Four twenty. Four twenty was today's measure, a treasure for some, a cause for pause to ponder Gaia. Dolphin deaths off Peru remained reminded true lovers she cries out for help. Sonambulant masses miss by design 
finer notes played on a scale for black birds. Would that words work to wake an adequate awareness army, for it is time to march. Voices of wisdom speak truths dulled by ad song and fractured gases. Global corporate pirates in bold livery plunder our mother out loud. Who shall throw down for Ma? Heaven can be hell. Heaven can be hell when angels disagree on issues such as wing color and configuration. No love is greater, more dynamic, more intense than that of angels, save perhaps that of dogs. Dogs epitomize the essence of loyalty. They truly love as if they were showing the way for feeling humans to contemplate, to follow. Hollow are obsessions with things immaterial, with objects of no value, with adversities. Divisions can occur where none existed. These can be dangerous to the strongest love. Divisions become cracks. Cracks become chasms or islands that break away diminishing love. When love of angels diminishes, they can be cast down to cold, dark places where the fallen wander. They ponder vague reflections in greasy puddles, seeking something to identify with or without. They shout at fleeting shadows and shapes. They shout at unglazed windows with drapes that move with chill gusts from the void. Heaven can be hell when nothing responds. And on that note, I shall bid you au revoir.